All right, welcome to another episode of the Final Percent Podcast. So there's a couple qualifiers. I am standing uh, at about 11,000 feet. Uh, Sal and I decided to take a bike ride over Medicine Bow National Forest, the Snowy Range. And I had this idea when I was coming back from Idaho after doing a real estate retreat. And I went down, it's one of the most beautiful roads. And I was going, I'm about 50 pounds lighter now. And I seek out mountains. I'm going to go conquer these mountains. And on 4th of July, I am actually going to go over these mountains. I'm going to do it with Sallow. And uh, he didn't know it at the time when I had this thought, just to let you guys know. But we're at the, we're at the peak. We're up here and we're trying to figure things out. Also, the, the other thing, the other qualifier is I'm going to be slapping bugs away from me because Wyoming has more mosquitoes than you can possibly imagine. But the thing that I want to talk about today is do you, when you wake up in the morning, do you go to battle or do you go on adventures? I don't know if you guys know this, but going to battle is really tiresome. Going to battle is very, well, it's not fun. It might be fun to win, but it's just so anxiety ridden and you don't know exactly where you're going to go. But the thing is, is if you go on adventures, it's usually who you're going on the adventure with. And it was interesting because Salo and I started this, uh, this ride and I just realized, okay, if Salo didn't come with me, I would have had to completely change my mindset. And I realized, and this is, this is what I was thinking about on the way up here. I mean, we we're like, only 14 miles into this thing or something and we've climbed almost 3,000 feet and we're like almost three hours into this or two hours into this or something but it's one of the hardest rides we've done but I would have had to gone to battle mentally physically because I'm alone and a lot of people are doing life alone and they won't ask for help they won't ask for guidance they won't ask for a buddy they won't ask for a guide they won't ask or create a community. And I often say that I love golf because golf really isn't how you play the game. It's who you tee off with. And I realized, you know, riding bicycles, living life, doing business, very much the same way. So you have to find your who. You have to find the people that you actually want to spend time with. And Sal and I were talking, uh, going over the mountain and, 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 and really, really attacking this. And we were just like, God, this never stops. We're just climbing and we're climbing and we're climbing. But we were able to offer each other, you know, encouragement. And we were able, one of the things that's, that's fun to say in, in the world of cycling is we're able to give each other the rabbit. So if I'm ahead of him, he has something to chase. If he's ahead of me, I have something to chase. But we're always there for one another. We're always there to pick the other one up, give each other encouragement. And that's really what this is all about, is going on adventures. When you wake up in the morning, choose to go on an adventure. When you wake up in the morning, choose to... You know, go conquer something with people, but you have to swallow a little bit of your pride because other people, if you have a community, they might, they might see you fail. Other people may have to pick you up. You may have to ask for help, but the thing is, it's so much better to experience life with other people. And so I invite you guys to really create a community. If you don't have a community, join ours. Come, come and hang out with the final percent. But it really is all about who you're spending the time with. And so many of you are waking up in the morning and you feel like you're going into battle. You feel like you're about to, you know, you know fight off the wolves, beat the wolves back from the door. And I invite you to experience life at a level when you wake up and you go, what would it be like? What, what adventure can I go on today? And who can I go on that adventure with? And that's one of the things that, you know, I get, I really get to, I don't have to, I get to hang out with Sallow because, I mean, 
one, one of the best photographers I know. He's behind the camera right now. We bring an, a, an incredible camera. We've got my podcast set up. We've got all of these different things. And he's able to run support with me to, to help get these concepts out and give me encouragement. And it's, he's somebody that I've gone on countless adventures with. And, you know, sometimes every now and then you have to go into battle with your tribe and that makes it way easier. And, and, and yes, sometimes, sometimes life just throws that. But most people are stuck in an ongoing battle. And they, are just, they, they feel like they have to battle everyone from the grocery store clerk to you know, the person on the phone that does, barely speaks English to the, the bank teller to you know, the person who cuts you off. Everything's a battle. And that's because you are not living your life as an adventure. And so I really invite you to live your life as an adventure, you know, crest crazy, cool mountain peaks and come see stuff like this. Like we literally started 3000 feet down and now here we are. It's a place called Mirror Lake and we're just looking at incredible, incredible scenery. So we're going to continue our adventure. We invite you to please uh, look at the YouTube channel because we've been actually chronicling. If you're listening to this right now, we're also filming it and we have been kind of documenting our journey ever since when we left my parents' cabin down in Centennial, Wyoming. So we are going to put a little uh, mockumentary, documentary-ish thing together uh, on the YouTube channel so that you can see some of the scenery that we are experiencing. So maybe join us on that adventure. Come see what us adventuring looks like and uh, we hope that you choose adventure over battle from here on out so this has been the final percent podcast it's the first-